dummies where I tell you. Yeah, I've got my uh I've got my thing on, so I hope we didn't mess anything up. That was weird. Hopefully, uh let's do the sword right now. You grab a practice sword. Which one do I want? This one should do. I'll be sparring with you today. I like your color, bro. Remember, these blades are dulled, but a sword's still a sword. Good luck. See how good I am at swords. Come on, keep at it. Let's see. See, sometimes they they use the wrong or different buttons. It's kind of weird. well four. Get off me, you bloody ox! You got lucky. What else do we have to do? Strength? Strength? You there, recruit. Scrawny, aren't you? See if you can carry one of these barrels over to the winch. What's in it? It's pitch. Where is Jump it? it off the wall and it'll burn the wildlings down to their fucking bones. Right. I can do this. Pitch is pretty cool. Oh, let's try that again. <sighs> Want some help? Thinking steward for you. You can help Frostfinger wash his cock. If the thing hasn't frozen off. Not bad. Oh, you're a prick. You know that. Yeah, I do. Fuck off. You didn't even try. A crossbow's a coward's weapon. Besides, I could hit that dummy from here with my... Where is it? Where the fuck's my knife? If someone has it, I'll cut their fucking balls off. How the fuck should I know? You were the last one I showed it to. Well, you and... It was you. What? You little fucking thief. It weren't me. Finn, don't. Give me my knife! I don't have it, I swear! Out of my way! Get it! Do something! But stop it! Before some. I won't say it again. That wasn't very nice. And how about this? Hey, look. Fight! Fight! Yeah, get it! There they go again. Get up! 
What is going what on here? Thing? I don't know. He stole my fucking knife. <clears throat> no, I didn't. And Garrett defended him. The last thief I caught no longer has hands. I swear I don't have it. He must have hid it. <laughs> and you? I expected better, Tuttle. Instead, I find you doing this on your first bloody day of training. Sir, I... Not another word. You clearly need a few days scrubbing the latrines. Frostfinger, I need another man atop the wall. Fine. Let him freeze his balls off. I'll deal with this one. Get off! <laughs> Mind your fucking manners. You, come with me. <laughs> Mind your fucking manners. <laughs> this way. I love King's Landing in the afternoon. The sun just barely kisses your skin. You used to love this place. Remember, we'd come listen to the musicians in the evening with Lady Marjorie. What did you want to talk about? Just through here. What are you doing? You'll see. Queen Cersei's finest wine. I hope you've got another one of those. <laughs> I never took you for a lush mirror. <sighs> Sadly, it's just the one. Yeah. A little won't hurt. Ah. <sighs> so, I uh Well, I just... I'm not very good at this sort of thing. Spit it out. Listen, if I tell you this, Mira, you must promise to keep it to yourself. You can tell no one. I want to trust you, but I need you to promise. I swear, I won't tell a soul. My mother was a handmaiden to Lady Elena for many years. She became pregnant. It was a disgrace to her family. My true name is Sarah Flowers. You're a bastard? Yes. I'm fortunate to be where I am, I know that. But to always have to hide. I don't want to hide from you as well. What happened to your mother? Lady Elena asked no questions. She took care of my mother. And when I was born, she gave me the name Durwell. My mother died not long after. Huh. Oh. I'm... I'm so sorry, Sarah. <sighs> it's just... I don't want to be Sarah Flowers forever. I need Lady Marjorie to arrange a marriage for me. It's my chance at a life. Did you have someone in mind? Someone you'd wish to marry? I'd have to convince Lady Marjorie to make an introduction first. I know she often confides in you, and I was hoping that maybe... Sometime when she comes to you wanting to talk, you might... Suggest she talk to me instead. Give me a chance to win her over. Coming from you, it's sure to mean a lot. Of course, Sarah. Thank you, Mira. Thank you. I'm so sorry. Here I am, talking about myself. 
I know your family's troubles are much greater than mine. With what happened to your brother and your father. You need this more than I do. Hmm. A conspiracy of handmaids. Oh, there he is. Oh. Lord Tyrion, my lord. Ladies? <laughs> lord Tyrion. What have we here? If you mean to drink from that flagon, you're going about it the wrong way. Care to join us, Lord Tyrion? Hmm. Not the finest arbor red, but a favorite of my sister's. Quite expensive for a handmaiden. I'd be curious to know how you got hold of it. <laughs> Since I'm certain my sister didn't give it to you, she won't even share with me. I took the wine from the cellars. Aren't you full of surprises? I suggest bringing cups next time. There are risks worth taking. Stealing wine from the Queen Regent isn't one of them. Especially if you wish to have an alliance with me. Things have changed. My father has recently taken an interest in Ironwood. Most of the Royal Navy went up in green flames. It must be rebuilt. He insisted I handle things myself. I'm on my way to meet oh, they can the use Ironwood Lord the Whitehill. Ships. Lord Whitehill? He's hired a pair of merchant lords to broker for his house. It would seem Lord Whitehill wishes to sell the Ironwood right out from beneath your family. I don't know much about the man, but judging by his up-jumped swords. You can't trust Lord Whitehill. I don't intend to. Come with me. These men think I have no choice but to deal with them. Imagine their surprise when I bring a forester to the table. It might be the first fun I've had in months. My lady. <laughs> 